Junkies. I'm your host, Scotty B, and today we're talking about California coffee company Addis Ababa. Now, Addis Ababa is the capital of Ethiopia, and it is a medium light roast, so I think I'm really going to like this because I love light roast, and it says, the perfect light roast lacking nothing. Welcome home. But, uh, yeah, so their notes are milk, chocolate, citrus, and caramel, so let's see what we get. All right, let's get a whiff. Very nutty, like cashews. Getting brown sugar, some uh, milk chocolate, dark chocolate, a little more milk. Yeah, just milk chocolate cashews. Let's grind it up. All right, freshly ground. Let's see how it opens up. Not as nutty as it was on the beans. The milk chocolate really comes through. With just a hint of cayenne pepper. Yeah, your typical coffee notes at uh, this point. I, I do drink Ethiopia a lot, so that's my frame of reference. Uh, Ethiopian coffees, so... Uh, Definitely smells it. All right, let's brew it up. All right, our fellow EKG gooseneck kettle is heated to 205. Everything's wetted and warm. So let's take out four tablespoons of Addis Ababa. All right, let's bloom it a little bit here. Swells up nicely on the bloom. Ah, that brew stink. It smells very pleasant, actually. Uh, we got kind of a, a vegetable stew right now. Not so much a beef stew, but... Ooh, and uh, fresh rolls. It's got cinnamon and caramel. Specifically like a caramel popcorn. It's got that corn dusting. Doing the brew dance. California Coffee Company is a black-owned business that often sets up shop at Vegan Exchange in NoHo, North Hollywood. So you can find their tent there and interact with them individually and buy their great coffee, or you can get it on their website, and I will link down below where you can find more information. Now it's got aged wood and milk chocolate and roasted almonds. Now it reminds me of an old hotel I stayed at, just the hotel air of uh, aged fabric, that carpet. Ah, memories. Now I'm getting an aromatic pipe tobacco. Absolutely beautiful oils on the surface. It looks like a nebula cluster or marble. It's amazing. Behold, with the power of the V60 pour over, we have achieved California Coffee Company, Addis 
Ah, bah, bah. Let's get a whiff. Mm. Smells like uh, roasted nuts. Getting some almonds. Maybe uh, roasted and frosted pecans. There's some milk chocolate. Mmm, that dusting of caramel sauce. Let's see how it uh, tastes. Ooh, wow. Nice and acidic, has that citrus kick. But it's uh, meaty. It's like smoked meats. Like a turkey leg at a renaissance fair. Very nice, has that bitterness. A nutty finish. Milk chocolatey. Not getting caramel on the taste, I did get it on the nose. Ooh, there's some caramel. Yeah, it has a caramel note. But it's all behind that smoky meat sauce. Let's uh, let it cool and come back to it, see what changes. Now I've been left with the lingering finish. And it does have a very chocolate caramel vibe, but there's also raw almonds, the uh, aftertaste of raw almonds on the finish. All right, let's come back to it. Hmm. Yeah, the caramel on the nose gets stronger as it cools. Let's see how it tastes. Caramel gets stronger on the uh, taste as well as it cools. Just a hint of milk chocolate on the finish. Not as meaty as it was on the first sip. It's uh, sweetened up. It is, it does have that citrus kick. Ooh, there, there's even a citrus note. And a creamy vanilla now. But it's not as acidic as I expected. Maybe because it's uh, medium light. But just a very welcoming flavor, and uh, one, it's an easy sipper, it's nice to enjoy. Overall, very fantastic. I, uh, I, I like both of them, both of the California Coffee Company uh, origins I've tried, but I think I do prefer the uh, Addis Ababa to the Changu. Well, that's it for Java Junkies. Join us next time every Monday at 8 a.m. Like, share, and subscribe.